So, I've had many people asking with Raids, Pets and Angel of Death that have come out since I got IFB, what am I up to, what are my plans and do I intend to get my Insane Final Boss title back? Uh, I guess you have to wait and see in this video to see what I've done. Um, no, first off, I've been pretty busy IRL so I haven't actually been playing that much but I did make a video about me getting the Beastmaster pet my first kill um, straight after release so that was pretty cool so that's basically that one done and dusted. Then there was Yakamaru. Now a friend of mine, Lax, was hosting good quality kills of sort of seven or eight kills an hour uh, in a team that was camping for pet. Lots of people with sort of fairly high KC, etc. So I decided to go uh, for a bit of fun as a change from Telos and wasn't too fussed about the Yaka pet, seeing as I didn't have Angel of Death, and that is going to be a significantly higher um, time requirement than Yaka, and I could probably just get it from doing the more raids. But anyway. So, uh, as you can probably see on screen, I managed to get hold of that after about 6 kills, which is kind of insane. However, my KC is about two, it's about 210 or 200 at the time. Um, so, not completely unsurprising, as I have quite a few thresholds there. Um, many people do seem to think that these raids pets are very common, but people seem to forget that they've come out sort of a year and a half after raids was released. Um, so... A lot of people have quite a high KC and, and a lot of thresholds. Anyway, uh, just my luck was still on point with this. Now the majority of my time over the past week or two when I've been logged in has been devoted to Talos. Um, I've been like so far behind with enrage building and being able to hold a decent streak without losing concentration or messing up or dying something stupid for ages. Uh, and I see a lot of people making absolute bank from Talos. Talos is like 40 to 50 mil an hour if you can do it pretty well at the moment, which is just nuts. Um, so I spent about 40 to 50 mil in deaths in the past three weeks, going from 500% to now I think I'm on 818% or something. Um, general thing I found, I fucking hate volcanic minions, just the end, period. Uh, especially at high range, but just generally. They're bloody and they stun you and you just die to rocks on phase 5 the whole time. Um, now, but seriously, the whole point of it was to, so that I would be able to do some decent streaking uh, and not die to stupid stuff uh, like splashing world magics and actually reflecting on phase one so you don't die to the uh, tendrils attack and stuff like that. Um, so I do want to try and get to 1k in rage. I've had quite a few decent sort of streaks in between. I find I have like starts and starts where I do like kill six, seven deaths in a row and then I'll do a three kill streak um, when I'm in the mood so that's that's quite nice actually. Um, but yeah, so I'm on 818% and I will continue doing that until I get 1k. Then, because I've been very busy RL, I have been logging in at kind of weird times or it's pretty much like doing Talos is fine because it's solo, but then when you try and find an AOT team, like I haven't been able to get a perm team because I can't log in consistently enough to sort of say, okay, yeah, I'll be on here and there and because I'm working a lot and stuff. So. It's been quite difficult, and I did decide to go. To, a friend of mine suggested to me that I go in a mass. Uh, there's an FC called Next AOD, which I can recommend to you. Um, a lot of people, if you're not that experienced in uh, Angel of Death, or you just want to finish your Reapers, um, because Next Angel of Death does give 42 Reaper points for a 12, like 12 Reaper, which is just insane. Um, but I managed to pick up my uh, like a personal keep codex because the mass is uh, Lucha keep on my very first kill, which at the time was about 700 mil, which was nuts. Um, so that was really cool to get. And then I've had a few other codexes and stuff in Seven Man, just doing kills with a um, Seven Man team from either like Bombi, uh, my clan shoe zone, or PMA. Um, and then last night I managed to end about a 10 hour dry streak, which was really nice with the codex. And then today, yeah, I um, this happened. Oh my god! Oh my god. Holy shit! Oh my, that's my third oh pick. No! <laughs> oh no! What the god. fuck? Holy shit. Dude, are you serious? Yeah, I picked it up, dude. Oh my lord. So basically, I got the pet on 
295 KC. It's 1 3000 drop rate and it has 1k S thresholds. Like, it's literally unbelievable. There's friends of mine, like Hamid has been hosting a perm team who are doing 6 to 8 hours a day, making bank admittedly, but trying to grind for that pet. Um, and kills are like 6 minutes probably on average, including banking time. So they only get about 8, 9, maybe 10 at max kills an hour, and some of them have like 1,600 KC. So to get my pet after 300 or 295 KC is literally insane. This does mean I have, as you'll see probably on screen, my insane final boss title back. I saved all the pets at once and I'm going to summon them now. Um, so I think I'm about the 10th person to get insane final boss back after the um, end of the death and raids update. Um, so that's pretty cool. I hope you enjoyed the compilation of stuff going on in the background. I'm not sure what I'm going to put there. Probably some death set titles and some angel death drops. Again, I'm sorry if I rambled too fast. Um, and I do kind of wish all the best of, uh, of luck to those camping into the death for their and take final boss title back. And uh, yes, that includes you and your team, Hamid, despite the fact that I get jealous as hell of your drops. Do feel free to smash the like button down below if you're new here and subscribe. And uh, I've got a few good ideas coming up, so I'll see you all. Peace.